So, uh, do you guys remember how I keep a separate save? Warning, catastrophic yeah, failure of fuel containment. Evacuate. Because, yeah, I'm just gonna lower it. It seems a little loud. Believe it or not, I was actually recording this earlier, and I lost all footage because my computer froze in the middle. So... Quite fucking useful that I actually just Special have a separate save in case something like this happens. Am I supposed to go? Okay, I'm supposed to go through here. Yeah, I tried recording this, but my computer froze, and I still don't know where the fuck I'm going or what I'm doing. I don't know shit in this game. I never do. You better get used to it. I I just suck at this. I suck. I suck at the uh, directions in this game. There it is. Oh, please tell me I didn't hear that. There you go. Ali help. Why did they just say that? That makes no fucking sense to me. I mean, what is Exiting zero on? gravity. I have issues. Exiting vacuum. I don't know if you ever noticed, but I have issues. Is everything loaded right now? Yeah, everything's loaded. Hi, I know you're right there. It's not an end as well as last time. Last time I got him in two shots from over there. Oh yeah, we're about to finish this chapter. <laughs> Which is a bit like, okay, I ended this, I ended the last episode. And I, I could have ended the chapter on the episode, but no. I have to end it on this. Like, on the very beginning of this episode. And we're gonna save, we're gonna save over that. You can see there already, it's called End of Days. Then again, eh, that wasn't actually a secret or anything, so. Oh, I've begun being a, bit, a little bit more uh, professional. I now close Facebook when I'm gonna start recording, and I put myself in as busy on Steam, and I don't have any friends in Origin, so... Well, I have one, but he never uses Origin. Isaac, I've located the shuttle Hammond found. <laughs> Shit. Oh, no good. That shuttle's brain dead. Someone removed the navigation cards. God knows why. There's three of them scattered around the deck. I'm downloading their locations. I can't access the doors from here, so you'll need a crew key. If you can find those parts, I think we can get that shuttle operational again. I heard that fucker. I heard something moving. You can't you can't trick me on that game. I know what I heard. What's here? Oh, alright. Fuck it, useful enough. What's this? <gasps> the five suit, yes! I like upgrading the suit because it looks better. The suit's like the only thing I have control over how it looks, so. Might as well enjoy it. Oh, text lock. Fucking great. <laughs> Z-Ball rules. Step on the lighted platform and activate it to start the game. Jump to as many scoring platforms as possible to increase your score, your score multiplier. Then use a kinesis module to grab the ball and shoot it into the active basket before the shot timer runs out. Beating each level opens a locker with a reward inside. You people want me to play this, don't you? I'm gonna suck at it. But I'll do it for you anyways. Just once, though. Come on. Entering zero gravity. There better not be any. Oh, come on! Interference! Not fucking cool. Shit. Why are these black? Hmm. This is not gonna end well for me. I'm not doing that again. Fuck you people. You tricked me. I'm not trusting you again. You tricked me into going there and you knew what was gonna happen. 
No, don't give me any of any of that crap about not knowing what the hell is gonna happen. I don't buy it. You people know everything, don't you know? You're supposed to know everything. Why? Because you have Google. You can pause the video at any moment and Google what the fuck's gonna happen. Uh... Oh, okay. You already heard me read that, so... Yeah, I'm not going there. Fuck that. I'll, I'd do it if it was just a game, but with the fucking Necromorphs? No, screw that. This, this ship is way too fucked. It's just way too fucked. How did I miss this? How am I so blind? I'm wearing my glasses. Oh yeah. Over here. That one was that one's still moving, so I'm gonna shoot it again. I did that because it looks psychotic that I shoot that human dead body and decapitate it. Just because. It gets worse when I explain my reason to, for it though. I shoot that thing because it freaks me out because it's moving and I think it might still be alive. So I literally decapitate a dead body because I think it's alive. Ain't I wonderful? How much for the level 5 suit? 60,000! My god! I'm in semiconductor. Oh my god, that's fucking creepy. I'm gonna save for it. I want it. I really want it. 60,000, I'm halfway there. Oh god, I have to read this again. This was a long one. United we ascend? Is Unitology any hope or just another scam? By Carrie Van Atken. If you've been living on Mars for the past 200 years, you might have missed the fastest growing religious movement in history. Unitolo Unitology boasts a following of millions, counts powerful CEOs and officials in its ranks, claims 78 billion dollars of stock in multi-global companies, and owns two of Earth's largest financial institutions, GPSG Financial and, Uni and Unitas Energy Investments. From its beginnings as a cult of personality, Unitology has become a respected ignore the pen that just fell, has become a respected established religion. Most people know the, know the basics. 200 years ago, Michael Altman, a professor of anthropology, blew the whistle on, on what he claimed was the biggest cover-up ever instituted. Sorry, something happened on my phone. The biggest cover-up ever instituted by Earth government. The discovery of an artifact, or marker, which proved beyond any doubt there is alien life in the universe. The government labeled Altman a cook. Cuck? Cook? I don't know. But his claims struck a chord with some, and his mysterious death soon afterwards fueled that interest. You don't kill the guy that's blowing the whistle on something. Even if he's crazy, you don't kill him and makes him a martyr. You don't want that. It creates this kind of shit. If you haven't noticed, Unitology is behind all this. Martyrs are never good for you. Unless it's a martyr on your side, then it's amazing. But a martyr on the enemy side? No, terrifying power. Shut up, Mia. You're not supposed to commentate. You just come here and watch, essentially. Yes, I love you too. Unitologists believe the marker contained a code, the key to eternal life, through rebirth and ascension to heaven. The kicker is you have to die first. They say the government is hiding the marker somewhere keeping its secrets for themselves. Of course, all of human space, Unitologists praise Altman's martyrdom, see, martyrs, and await the day God comes to take them to their new life beyond death. It all sounds pretty harmless, but like any cult, there's a dark side. Unitologists are ranked in the church. Nobody ever talks about it, but most of its critics believe there are at least three ranks above the average believer, or initiate. With each new rank, more of the church's inner, inner workings and research is revealed to a follower. And these ranks are achieved by one simple criteria. 
giving money and power to the church. Think taking all your money is bad? The church also requires members to know to donate their bodies after death. Why? What do they do with them? Nobody will say. And attempts to infiltrate this, the inner circle have failed. With our emphasis on transformation and rebirth, maybe you wouldn't like the answer even if they told us. One rumor that also refuses to die says the church is funding a secret shipbuilding program. Some claim to have even seen the fleet. No documentary evidence has ever been supplied, but the claimants all say these mausoleum ships, despite their huge size, at the end on page 94. Now, I'm gonna be quiet for a minute, and I want you to just listen to the background music. I'm not doing a good job by utilizing all this noise. Poor judgments and decisions, that's what I got from that. Yeah, the fuckers are singing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, it's creepy as fuck. Also, the fact that that song is there tells me we're actually very close to the end. May yeah, yeah, we're in chapter 10 of 12. So I could tell we were kinda close to the end, but it seems even closer now that that song's there. Am I supposed to go that way? Then I'm going this way. Yeah, typical RPG gamer. Go to where you're not supposed to be going. Oh wait, I remember where this goes. Yeah, this is Amelia? No. No, no. The shuttle is mine. I control access to the shuttle. If you could make the journey, I could fix everything. He's useless. I'm sorry, Mr. Clark. Unless you can prove to me you can get it spaceworthy again, I'm afraid I can't let you through. I need to know you're on my side. I have no idea who that guy is. Does anybody remember who that guy is? I can't remember us being introduced to him. Also, yeah. What do you cling to when all must seem so utterly hopeless around you? Dr. Cross was a true believer. She had faith. And now she awaits her transformation. Her rebirth. Are you ready to ascend, Mr. Tumble? Of course you are. Have no fear. You will play your part soon enough. Witness the conviction of a true believer! Yep. They are ready. Take them. Embrace them! Yep. Look at how fucked this place is. It's kind of impressive. He's still going over there. If we could get through this, it would be so quick. It's just one shot right there. Yep, and now I gotta follow him. Actually, can I go that way? I wanna go this way, see if there's anything I can sell over here. I want that level 5 suit, okay? Don't judge me. Ah, fucking of course. Reload, uh, reload, Clark. Thank you, Isaac. Oh my god, I'm such a shit shot in this game. I'm not this bad. Usually. I'm not good by any stretch of the imagination, but I'm not this bad. Yes, please, I need more healing back. Oh well, thank you. That's contact energy and contact energy. I should not have picked up that weapon, because now they're giving me ammo for it. Which this drops like to potentially be health otherwise. Which I really fucking need, honestly. These keep me semiconductors. Credits don't give me enough. Unless you give me like 
12,000 credits at once or something like that. You're not gonna give me enough credits. As I would get with semiconductors, which can be worth a fuck ton. More contact energy, Christ. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to go for it. The thing is, over there at the bottom, there's something I really don't want to face. This is fucking disgusting, just listen to the sound. Ah, kinda makes me want to puke if I'm honest. I know you're gonna break through, the thing is, I can't do it for you. So come on. Are you gonna break through the other one? Which one do you wanna break through? Oh no, that's right, he goes back in there and then he jumps us, I think. You jump us, I know. You're not just gonna not jump us. I need all the money I can get. I'm gonna fight so this gun looks so fucking cool. Also, yeah. These are things I don't like dealing with because of what they do after they get killed. They turn into these monstrosities. They're fucking annoying to deal with. Give me the fucking flame power. Nope, wrong thing. Purify them. Let fire purify this fucking place. Accept the flame. Accept the flame. You greet. Cleanse, you fuckheads. Fucking better. Now back to the plasma cutter, because it's actually a better weapon. It's just that I don't like having to aim for those things because I'm not gonna hit them. I, I can't reliably hit them with plasma cutter. So I just spray fire in their direction and they die. Much better. Oh my god! That freaked me the fuck out! Fuck you. It's one of three, isn't it? I can't possibly be able to. Why did I just stomp? That was stupid. I should not be stomping right now. Come on, I gotta go back up and get the other two, right? I, ca I can't be done. Oh my god, there's even Mr. Clark, I really must speak with you. I'm very close to your position and and I know you want to hear what I have to say. I can explain all this. So what happened? You're gonna die. When you have the map cards, I'll let you into the security station. We must talk. Hurry! Shut up. I tried to get in, you didn't let me. Am I going that way now? Yeah. I think the door that was closed is now gonna be open. Nope, I prepared it sometime. Curious. Yeah, you freaked me the fuck out. Why do you have this one door right here? Shut up! You were being mean to me just a second ago. You freaked me out. I'm trying to reload this just in case. You never know. Is this another the kind life support of pub system in Sleep Lock B has been shut down. You'll have to find an override nearby to get to the door. Sleep Lock. Sleep Lock. Fine. Sure. You wanna have Sleep Lock B. 
You're gonna get up. How are you not getting up? Okay, this is freaking me out more than anything else, I think. The fact that that one is just dead. This is about as far as I'm gonna go right now. Kind of freaked out by everything, and hey, we got a time for something. And yeah, like I really mean, I'm gonna interrupt the ending of the video. Yes, I'm talking to you. Like I picked up saying in For Honor. Thank you for joining me in this part of the book. We'll pick up again in the next bit. Bye bye, travelers.